So, and again, everything, it, it, all the meaning in, in our client's life is a metaphor that their mind has created. The meaning was put on it by their unconscious mind. Reality is not what's happening out here. It's how it's being processed in here. And that's why everybody's realities are different. You can have the same experience as 10 other people and everybody remembers it differently and has a different outcome from it or a different uh, emotional reaction to it or whatever, because we're all using our different maps. The best thing I think hypnotists can do to improve their skills is to improve their listening skills and to really learn to approach things without judgment, without a preconceived idea of what they think it is before they before you know they do something or before they approach a technique once we've learned some skills we can trust that they're just going to show up for us you know and it doesn't have to be the way it was written in a book somewhere or the way some teacher taught it to us it can take on that life of its own based on what were the feedback loop again virginia satir when we're getting that feedback from the client in live time that's when our our creative mind will help us to guide them in a direction that we could have never thought about ahead of time. Just in that moment, it'll say, go this way. And if we trust ourselves, then they're going to, they're going to just have these amazing experiences. It's, it's truly remarkable. So the creative mind is, you know, again, it doesn't have rules and metaphors work best because of that. It has a lot more space to do things. It's a lot more, it's freer. It's a lot more freedom to explore possibilities. You know, I love that word. <laughs>